happy May! I have a new song for you this month. You might remember it from last summer. It's called Five Little Ducks. So sing along with me. We'll be singing this a couple times this month. Five little ducks went swimming one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 but only four little ducks came back. Four little ducks went swimming one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 but only three little ducks came back. Three little ducks went swimming one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 but only two little ducks came back. Two little ducks went swimming one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 but only one little duck came back. One little duck went swimming one day over the hills and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 and five little ducks came swimming back. Good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday. It's May. It's starting to get warm outside and all the flowers are coming around and the bees. I have a really good story for you today. It's called Ella Pants. Like elephants, but it's Ella Pants. And let's see what happens in this story. You're going to like it. It's got really cute pictures and fun little designs. Oh, it looks like it takes place out in the jungle where the elephants live. Ella Pants. Look at her pants. Oh my goodness. Ellie was the biggest girl in town. She pushed the other girls around. Uh, look at her. She's an elephant, so she's really big and she just bumps everybody around. She told them where to go and when. Not really like a proper friend. She's being bossy, I think. Being very bossy. Mouse said, does it have to be this way? Must we always do just what you say? Ellie snorted, stomped, shook one ear. Hang on, she said. I thought it was clear. Uh-oh. I'm the leader, not by chance. Look at my wondrous Ella pants. Oh, she thinks she's in charge because she's got pretty pants on. Mm hmm. They're big and shiny and bright blue. I have a red pair for weekends too. Look, look at all her pants and socks hanging on the line out there. I have the biggest pants in town. That's why I boss you all around. Um, I don't think they like that. They don't like that. She's being bossy just because she's got pretty pants. At that, the animals all started speaking, mooing, hooting, chirping, squeaking. Uh-oh, they're going to tell her how it is. But then came a noise from by the lake, so loud it made the jungle shake. Somebody's, somebody's coming. Uh-oh, said Mouse. What could it be? 
there's something moving through the trees. Then suddenly a terrible roar. I think that it's the Pantasaur. Oh no, you got elephants and now you have Pantasaur. I bet that dinosaur is bigger than elephants than Ellie is. It's worse, groaned Ellie. I know that noise. We should have tidied up our toys. Then through the trees crashed Ellie's mother in enormous pants of brilliant color. I have the biggest pants of all, she said. So listen up, it's time for bed. Uh-oh. And so Ellie learned that it was true. Someone's always got bigger pants than you. Look at that. They didn't need to be listening to Ellie. They got to listen to the mama. Her mama had bigger pants on. Look at that. I hope you like that story. Stay, stay tuned for a really fun craft. Hey guys, I hope you like that story about Ella Pants and her pretty, pretty pants. Um, today, we are going to make an elephant puppet and you're gonna get out your um, May Storytime Adventures packet, which you can pick up here at the library anytime. And you're going to get, in that, you're going to get this elephant. And I, colored mine. You can get your crayons out of your um, green story time backpack. And I colored my elephant with crayons and then I cut him out. And you'll see there's a circle here, right here in its nose. And you're going to cut that out. You can practice cutting or get mom and dad to help. And so you cut out this here. What do you think this is going to be? What, where does, what's supposed to go there? That's his trunk that goes in there. But look what we're gonna do. We're gonna make a puppet. And he's gonna do, he, look at this, it could be your girl elephant or your boy elephant, which one you want. You could be Ellie from the story and you could pretend like she's bossing everybody around. You could get out your little kitty cats and um, in your story time backpack or you could get your little dolls out and play or you get some, get your dinosaurs out and you can make this little puppet and she walks around just like this. It was fun to make. I really liked making this one. I thought it was super cute. All right. I hope you guys like story time today. I will see you next week with a really cute book. 